expected to drive into the Idaho Center parking lot tomorrow for Nampa's biggest concert of the year. I'll tell you about some changes you need to know before even walking through the door. Cooler weather has moved into the northwest. We'll be heating up, but will that last into the weekend? Today's 6, on your side at 10, starts now. The Idaho Center is preparing for one of its biggest events of the year tomorrow night with thousands expected. Parking headaches may arise. But even before you get in, you're going to have to pony up some cash. Eric Fink is in the studio with tonight's big story. Michelle Rowland, tomorrow's annual God and Country Festival is expected to draw thousands to the Idaho Center's amphitheater lawn. The concert, it's always free, but you better have some plastic or at least a five in your wallet. The parking lot of Nampa's Idaho Center is wide open Tuesday, but in hours, thousands of cars will pack the lot for the annual God and Country Festival. But getting in and out of the Idaho Center could mean plenty of sitting and waiting for anxious concert goers. When the lots are full, we'll be turning those people away to find alternative parking, and there won't be the driving around, looping around, looking for uh, parking all over the place. It actually makes it more organized. 27 Nampa cops will be on hand. The majority of them will be out directing traffic, trying to get people through without many stops. But everybody's going to stop at least once to pay for parking. The festival is free. Parking will cost you five bucks. After the fireworks grand finale, several detours will take effect. One of the main things is on Franklin Road is usually a two-way road. We're going to borrow the westbound lane of that. Franklin westbound to Star Road will shut down at 1030 Wednesday night. No different than, uh, you know, Boise State football game clearing out with that much traffic or anything. It is the largest one we do in Nampa. We always project ourselves at a 45 minute mark on clearing our lots. But that's only a projection. The God and Country Festival sees on average an extra 6,000 people pack the amphitheater lawn for the fireworks alone. And the Idaho Center doors open tomorrow at 5 p.m. The concert begins at 5.30. And that fireworks show is expected to start around 10.20 tomorrow evening. Again, five bucks to park. They will take Visa and MasterCard along with cash. And for more on the God and Country Festival, head to our website. It's IdahoOnYourSide.com. Live in studio tonight, Eric Fink, Today 6, On Your Side. School's out for summer, but the controversy over school reform laws.